Hello? I'll hit ya. What is that? Oh my god! Fucking God. Oh, 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 oh. No! It's called failure. It's not the falling down, but the staying down. Very good. Thing. It's time for the next game, I think. What the fuck is that? Oh my God, go, go, go. What are you doing? Go. Damn it! I saw it out in the distance, just the lightest little, not little, but like, out there. Oh my god, what the fuck is that? We're gonna die. We're gonna fucking die. Ah! Holy shit! What the fuck? Oh my fucking god. Holy shit! Ah! Alright, well, no sense of putting a beacon there unless you just say, don't ever fucking go there again. But, um, I'm here to do. Oh, look at the group. Ah! Oh, fuck me! Oh! Holy shit! Oh my god. Oh, ho, 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 my god. Oh, god. <laughs> oh no, this one already tastes fucking weird. God, I think this is that. Oh no! Uh. Oh, put music on. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh no! I'm just a little guy, and it's my birthday. I'm a little birthday boy. I'm just a little guy. Ooh, woo. Let me go restart. We go back upstairs to the tarot cards. And we'll, uh... <laughs> oh, Jesus fucking Christ! Come the fuck on with this shit! Fuck! Oh, my God.
Come on, Grandma. Let's go. I did not Whoo! Fuck you! Was that f you, bitch? Fucking bastard tree. Oh. Thank you for the bits either way. Son of a <laughs> ah, Fuck me! Oh, she did it again! Fuck! Oh, that was goddamn assisted double. It's got me. Almost fucking got me. I swear to serve but something went wrong. Question is, what went wrong? I bet you're gonna find out. <laughs> oh. God, that was cheap as fuck. See you, bro. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, I fucking hate you guys. <laughs> aye, aye, aye. Unbelievable. See you later. Completely unbelievable. I have no yeah. access to the vents. Have fun getting killed by the shortest 37 year old in the US. You <laughs> 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 noticed that before. It's always been such shitty weather. What the hell is that? Ah! I fucking hate you. <laughs> You're the worst kind of person. I'm so sorry. I thought this. Was, I thought. I thought she was gonna try to frame me because I killed sorry? her in the last game. Sorry. Yes, I'm very sorry. <laughs> sorry, Jeff. <laughs> She's finally on mute. The sorry, fucking audacity. <laughs> I I voted for him. I didn't vote for you. I listened. I, I voted. Oh, that was great. Cause then I just saw heavy all alone. And I was like. Oh, yeah. Taylor, Lisa Taylor, Lisa Taylor. Go. Or to crackers and ah. um. Of course, I used to. Oh, there's a blue light. Some flares that I don't need. Cool. <laughs> Scared the fuck out of me, man. Hitting pause and also me dying on the. I think that's the classic tree jump scares jugs clip. I think that was the first time. Now that I think back on it. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Ah! <laughs> yeah, indeed. Hello, Fry. Hello, Polish. Uh, so, Halloween's over, sadly. But Jugtober rolls on for the last, uh, last few stops in town. Touchy, touchy. What in the world was that? <laughs> Thank you, Twisted, for the bits. Oh my god. That's fucking horrifying. 
<laughs> Hope you've been well, pal. Uh, so yeah, uh, in case you missed the news last night on Discord or Twitter, you can now look over that channel direction. You will see that we broke the $1,000 mark. And uh, moving right along too, almost at the 1,050, uh, which will get us the final watch party for Jugtober, which is Train to Busan, one of my favorite zombie films of, uh, I'd say, recent memory, as far as I can think back on. Um, it's a great movie, and, and I think the last watch party we had with the double, uh, double header there was a good time. So if we get there, great. I'll be looking forward to hosting that one. Um, let's see what else we got going on. Oh, yes. So by passing the $1,000 mark, I also now have to eat that goddamn pink tiger pepper, whatever the hell monstrosity that is that's in my freezer. Uh, so that's going to get scheduled. I will probably end up doing it maybe a night this week. I don't know. Uh, but more than likely the weekend, just so I can have a day to like process it and not die. I pray for raising this money for this cause, man. It hits home and sincerely means a lot. Hey, I'm just, I'm just a guy spouting up on the hilltop. It's every, everyone like you, Polish, and everyone else in chat that's that's raising the funds. I just, I just created the bucket. You know, don't eat it if it's moldy. Yeah, no, of course not. I put it in the freezer to try to save it. Um, but if it's moldy, I will uh, obviously pass on it and I will make up this terrible injunction because uh, I have a friend that grows his own peppers. I may be able to snag one or two from him. I don't know if he does those in particular, but are the donations to the donate button? Oh, Twiz, my apologies. So there'll be a link coming into chat or if you go down, you'll see Tiltify panel, either or. Um, that goes right to uh, donating to the the uh, campaign that's running through Tiltify. They're the ones that are handling all the funds and providing the funds to Hope for the Day. Uh, and it is the best bet you have to get the all of your money to uh, the charity versus... Excuse me, I keep rubbing my eye. So I've been MIA for personal reasons for a hot minute. Hey, do, hey, do you don't gotta apologize, man. I totally get it. I'm just a guy playing video games. You got you got real world shit to worry about. I mean, we all do. So, no, not judging. I hope you. I hope you are well. Hope your family is well. Um, you know. So, uh, but yeah, uh, obviously subs, bits, all that stuff from this uh, stretch of time. Uh, I'm pushing right in as well. Doing well. All right, good. Glad to hear that then. That's whatever happened, I'm sure happened. And now you're on the other side of it and I'm glad you're here and I'm, I'm glad you're, you know, of all, of all the things you'd be doing tonight, you're here hanging out with us um, to appreciate you. Um, oh, and another thing I forgot to mention, uh, you may notice like the like background blurriness uh, that I was kind of using on purpose, I have since removed. As you can see, I finally got rid of all of my beer shit. Not rid of it, it's it's in the closet that's like over, over there. <laughs> but uh, I wanted to start cleaning some shit up and I felt like I started getting enclosed in here. The closet had a bunch of stuff in it I didn't need. Um, other than that, there's a bunch of like posters and a bunch of other things I have on the ground. I'm gonna like line the walls and everything. And... Oh, okay. Yo, what the fuck, Twisted? Yo, dude. I have no fucking words, man. Uh, oh, I mean, I do. It's thank you. <laughs> I, I can say thank you. I believe I could do that. Oh, my God. <laughs> Polish's cock is hard that fast. Unbelievable. <laughs> Twisted. Holy shit, man. Thank you so much. That's that's outrageous. Um, I gotta get this fucking flashbang of a fucking website of theirs. 
I'm sorry, I didn't have my tracker open. Oh, no way. Thank you, Fry. Oh, that's probably gaming. This looks like. What game is this? This looks familiar. Oh. <laughs> Fucking damn it! <laughs> yep. The oh. second I saw the portrait. Liz, you remember when we talked about, like, you know, you get mad when you get scared? <laughs> That was one of those moments. Yeah. Um, by the way, uh, so Mirror Forge, um, did you ever play the second demo? I know that was the first demo. All it takes is a $250 dono. I guess so, Polish. <laughs> um, so let me see here. That That's going to be a lot of things. So we have the Watch Party, Train to Busan. That's, that's in there for $1050. 1100 Steam Game Giveaway. So we're going to do a Steam Game Giveaway in a little bit here then for sure. Uh, and then 1150 is Hot Sauce Wheel Spin times three. Oh, great. That's, that's great. 1200. Oh, shit. Unlocked the Dye Hair and Beard stream. Oh man, that's gonna be fun. We're gonna have to plan that for some time. Maybe I'll do it Friday. Oh, maybe Friday. We'll see. But uh, yeah, I have. Actually, it's over here. So you obviously can't tell the colors that well in the red. Um, but this one is. Uh, I think it's supposed to be like a gold color, like yellowish gold. Yeah, you can kind of tell. And this one is purple. So I figure what I'm gonna do is with the lighter color, I'm gonna put a uh, hair at the top of my head and then the purple is gonna go right in the beard. Um, so we'll have a stream where I actually apply this shit and then hang out and play games. So uh, thanks for unlocking that dude, <laughs> oh my God. Okay, what else, what else, what else? And then there's another one at 1250 is another three hot sauces. What the fuck are you trying to kill me? <laughs> we could actually get to the PT stream. I don't remember where the PT stream is. So I know, so our next thing is at 1300. That's Jackbox party game community stream. That's gonna be fun as hell. And we still have to plan the Fall Guys community stream. Oh my goodness. So many things to do. Steam game at 1350, 1400 is scrutinized, 1450 merch, 1500 <laughs> Reaper, 1550 Steam game, 1600 is watch scary video, 1650 is hot sauce, seven, 1700 is PT. So about less than 500 away. It's very possible, it's very possible. Holy fuck. Um, all right, I need to write this shit down to remember like, so, Hot Sauce X6, we still have to do Fall Guys and um, Steam Game and Air Beard Dye Stream. I think that's everything. I feel like I'm on top of the ball now. Oh, Pink Tiger, <laughs> fuck me. Pink Tiger. And uh, Green to Busan. My God. Steam game, hot sauce, dye hair, hot sauce. Okay, cool. All right, thanks for bearing with me on that one, everybody. Uh, Jesus Christ. Fucking Twiz coming in here and completely throwing me off the mark in like the best way possible. <laughs> Jesus. Um, so, okay. Uh, <laughs> um, why don't we, since we haven't quite started the game yet, and once I start this game, which kind of sucks, which I'm not a big fan of, is um, I can't change the video quality settings at all. It's a good looking game. It plays fine, but my webcam just starts to shit in the bed, like freezes up and whatnot. So there's not much I can really do in terms of that today. Uh, I hope that maybe changing the maybe disabling the the blur on the camera maybe might help i don't know uh 
Either way, we're going to find out. But before we do that, since Twisted, you're here, obviously. Uh, let's handle two of those Hot Wheels sauce spin. I will not. I'm sorry. We have to do. It's three. I have to do three. Three. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, there's th number three. Hi, I'm Steve-O, yes, and this is, is the Pussy Blast Off. Riz, welcome in. Riz, you just missed it. I'm Steve-O, and this is the Pussy Blast Off. Yes, it is. Um, Twisted just came in here and dropped a 250 bomb on donations. Um, so I'm doing, a, I'm doing a bunch of hot sauces right now. Well, I'm going to do half of them that he just got, which is three. We got the um, uh, Twisted Souls. Uh, so there was uh, Trained Abuse on Watch Party Unlocked, two different Hot Sauce X3s, um, Steam Game Giveaway, and um, uh, Hair and Beard Dye uh, stream. So that's gonna be fun. I got a bunch of stuff I have to schedule out now. What a lad. Let's see, 17. <laughs> it's always the last one. It's always the last one. Sorry about that. Okay, so that's two. Got one more coming. Oh, no. God damn it. It was going so well, too. Number 10. Okay, great, lovely. Hmm. You know what? I bought a thing of eggnog for the uh, the spicy gummy bear, and I still have some more left. Fucking chug this after number ten. <laughs> this shit is fucking horrid. The hot sauce, not eggnog. I fucking love eggnog. I normally don't get one. I I normally don't get it until December because I see it as a Christmas drink. Maybe Thanksgiving. Maybe. But I see it as more of a Christmas drink. And I like to make sure I keep those three holidays separate for their own times, their own months. As many other people, I'm sure, would feel that way. Chug the nog. Today is Christmas first. No, no. Bad Riz. Bad Riz. Bad. <laughs> the nog or not. <laughs> Oh, that's that's a concept. I like it. <laughs> all right, let's get you uh, let's get you all back over here. Uh, exactly two days of Thanksgiving in the middle of Christmas. <laughs> oh my God, at least it gets two. You call it Black Friday's part of Thanksgiving, I guess you're saying. I was just discussing this with Heavy. I mean, that's fine. Uh, so yeah. Number three. Number three, my lord. Thursday and Friday, because I get both those days off. I don't participate in Black Friday. Get not bad. Gotcha. Um, yeah, I end up having to usually work Black Friday. Um, in like every job I've ever had, <laughs> so whether it's working in the food industry or as a bank teller or now in IT, uh, and I can't even ask for the t I can't even ask for that time off for that day 
it's one of the busiest days of the year for us because now I work for an e-commerce platform. So it's literally the busiest day of the year for us. Uh, so right here is we need to go to gather up some more for your charity. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Twisted. Please don't break me. Okay, this one is the Plum Dog Millionaire. We actually pulled this one last night too during the Vecna stream. If you missed the Vecna stream, it's not up. It's not gonna be up on YouTube for a while because I'm so behind on, on posting VODs. Um, but you can watch it right on Twitch here. Uh, it was pretty goofy. Um, the Outlast Trials was fun though. I'm looking forward to, to playing that when it comes out for sure. Maybe with other people too, so. <laughs> the hell emote is that? I'm gonna hover over it. Oh, you got oh you got fucking bits once that's sick. That's fucking sick, mate. I was like, I thought it was uh I thought it was the jigsaw guy at first, and I was like, wait, what? <laughs> nice. Alright, well Plum Dog Millionaire. Um just, I don't want I'm not trying to stall here. It's King Star White Thai chilies, red jalapeno chilies, fresh Plums, yes. Carrots, ginger, molasses, and cinnamon. Awesome. All right, well, cheers to you all. <laughs> yeah, that one's got some fucking heat to it. Okay. Ugh. Number 10 is glaring at me. I fucking hate this one. Yummy. Yeah, I know that those the the bigger bottles that got the gonzo sauce. Um I keep forgetting to fucking post that goddamn Facebook page again. I'm going to put it in Discord, I swear. Um he doesn't have a web story yet but you can contact him through Facebook and I think he does it through like Venmo or PayPal um, but it's legit I ordered one of every sauce that he had and he sent me one of every sauce and some stickers and a bag of fucking peppers which I did not ask for those God, I don't want to fucking do this I don't Butt cheek! What up, dog? Welcome in. How you doing? Uh, you made it just in time. I now have to uh, drink one of my most hated hot sauces, the number 10. Um, Twisted made it so that I had to drink six of them, and we decided to do three for now, three for later, for my own goddamn health. Um, it's not as bad as the gummy. It's going to taste as bad. Honestly, that gummy, like I went to bite into it and it just had a weird give to it. And I knew right away it was, it was it. I was like, well, I'm fucked. And it was like no flavor until I was like halfway through it. And it just tasted just like 10 through 12. Like this capsicum extracts on that for sure. I don't know how many, I don't know how strong, but it gets up to 9 million somehow. So, uh, it, in essence, take that 9 million Scovilles, drop it down to 1 million. Still sucks. So pissed I missed that. <laughs> um, there's a clip that exists. Tree was actually kind enough to uh, clip the beginning of it. I'm going to eventually do a little like highlight reel of it and uh, put it on YouTube. Um, when? I don't know. I Hopefully tomorrow, otherwise I'm going to owe another goddamn gift sub. Is there any meaningful difference between 1 million and 9 million? Um, probably flavor, because there was none at 9 million. It was just all pain at that point. Yeah. The gummy is fucking hot. Yeah, it was, it was bad. That took a lot. About 9 oh fucks. <laughs> Aunt, yeah, dude, it hurt my gut for, like, the rest of the day until I started, like, I got to dinner and I started feeling better. And I was like, okay, cool, I can actually eat. And I ate, and it was good. And then, like, I streamed last night. Um... And I was actually okay. He said, oh no. It is true. I said, oh no, at first in, that, in those clips. I think it turned to, oh fucks, really quick. Huh. All right. Enough with the stalling. 
Here's number 10. Don't kill me. Oh my god. The first and only hot thing to make my stomach hurt so far. Um, I would say... <laughs> I had a weird combination one night. I still don't understand what happened. I think, I think it was a fluke. Um, and I had food poisoning. Um, but there was one night I had to end stream. After doing some hot sauces, my stomach just fucking flipped. And I was like, oh god. Um... And I, I went and got sick off stream, and it sucked, but um, I think it was a fluke because I had had like two or three hot sauces, like right, like what I just did, almost like the same line. And uh, I've done more than that before. I didn't have a problem. But I made it longer with the realization of the incoming pain could not be missed. Oh, for sure. Oof, that sucks. <laughs> Let me put these away really quick. That was interesting. I'll never forget this one time <clears throat> went to a local uh, bar, me and Papa Francis. And we racked up like an $120 bar tab. Chugs, chugs, no, I get a hit some more experience. <laughs> we drank a ton. Paid our tab. Oh my god. Fucking lips are on fire. And uh we ended up going over to the Royal Garden uh across the street from this bar. Typical Polynesian Americanized Chinese food. And we get there. Got a scorpion bowl for two, which is this big fucking fruit punch drink that has just a shit ton of booze in it. And we drank the shit out of this. And I fucking blacked out. And I came to at my other friend's house, my friend Mike. His roommate Tom came and picked us up down at the gas station where we got snacks. I came to in the in this dude's room. Um uh, apparently a pipe was being passed around and it was in my hand and I was like, mm, I'm going to pass up on this. Not a good idea. <laughs> Papa Andrew, Papa Francis is fucking not feeling good. And then I realized like, mm, my stomach feels funny. Nothing happened, but it just felt weird. And I looked down, I was eating Andy's hot fries and drinking eggnog. I'm like, who made this decision in my life? It wasn't me, I swear. <laughs> But apparently it works because I've now done that twice in the last 24 hours. 36. Subliminal. <laughs> ah! Yeah, that's that's kind of the noise I made when I realized what I was doing. It's my poor upper GI. Really the whole GI if I really think about it, but Okay. Let's see. Uh, excuse me. That explains so much. Yeah, and why you shouldn't abuse alcohol. I agree. Speaking of which, I'm going to get a beer. Hmm. Oh. I forgot I had a candy maker left, which is a peanut butter stout. Candy Maker. It's from uh, from Widowmaker in Braintree, Massachusetts. Cheers to you all on this lovely November first.
Oh, so fucking smooth. Every time I have that fucking beer, it gets better and better. <clears throat> okay. Notes are all updated. I've got everything going. We're good. It's time for my webcam to start looking like shit. Let's go play some Love Sam. All right, let's see. Am I immediately fucked? We're going to find out. Hit continue. It was after, it was right as the game gets into it. Oh my god. It's doing, I'm doing so much better. I think. Yeah. Uh, was that seriously it? The little motion blur shit? Beer 30. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I used to, uh, I used to fucking slam down beers. Oh, it's just not good. I've come a long way in life. Have I been drawing shit? Alright. Where we leave off here? Because of her, the moment she came into our lives, what little I had to enjoy started to crumble. Only bad changes happen in my life, no matter how hard I try to protect it. <laughs> a city girl just asking to become an outsider. That was all she was to me. Hell, that was all she was to everyone else. But then I saw them talking at the library. I couldn't see clearly, but I could tell what was going on. He was making her smile. It was another smile taunting my feelings for B. No one would ever know what kind of emotions I was hit with at that moment. A change was happening. I didn't like it at all. Stacy didn't like it either. And she could never stand letting an easy social prey slip away from her. Naturally, Stacy took a peek into her diary one day. She took pictures of some of the entries and sent them to me and her gang. She wanted everyone to join her twisted and childish game. What a bitch, huh? <laughs> the diary had no special meaning to me. Not until I read about how Brian took that gun on a fucking tour of the town. He had no interest in girls whatsoever, and suddenly so now he's hanging out with an outsider? At that moment, I got tired of doing nothing. I knew I had to do something, so I gave Stacy an idea. It was going to be easy. Spike her drink, get her wasted, and humiliate the shit out of the city girl in front of everyone. Only then she would know her place. So the narrator seems to have changed uh, position here. I'm and it's not Stacy. so who could this be writing? Because it's not Sam. <coughs> Obviously not Brian. I'm just white girling it up over here with Seagram's peach belly. Ooh. Sounds lovely. <coughs> uh, it could have been so simple, only if B didn't get in the way. Bummer was hoping to do nasty stuff to her drunk ass. Still can't believe Brian had to take her away like that. Well, needy bitches like Sam does tend to make some people feel sorry. She did mention something about her dad in her diary, but she has some nasty daddy issues too. Got an idea. How about we show everyone how needy a bitch can be? Hmm, sounds fun, but how? Jesus. I thought we... Oh, we did this part already. This scared the life out of me. Oh. No, 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 no. This can't be happening. Oh, God. Uh, hate that. Hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? November 6, 2006. I don't even know how to describe what happened this morning. This is fucked up. My hands are shaking again. It's there when I opened my locker and something poured out. For a few seconds, my brain was cut off from whatever was happening. When I finally looked down, there were dozens of pictures scattered on the hallway floor. All of them were pictures of Brian with gibberish written on them. The whole school was at the hall, looked at the pictures, then at me, and then at the pictures. Brian was there too. The face he gave me, the face of disgust. 
He turned away and left. He didn't even say anything. I tried to chase him, say something, anything to him. But the floor started spinning and people started whispering like they knew what was going on. The air soon began to choke my throat. I swept, I swept what was on the floor and ran off to class. Of course, Stacy must have, must have something to do with this. I looked for her, but she was nowhere to be found. The rest of the day was about nothing but avoiding eye contact with anyone. I can't sleep. Brian's not answering any of my texts. There's no one to talk to. That's sad. Poor Sam. Oh. Be, 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 be. Kept saying nothing was going on between them. But I wasn't about to believe everything was just fine. Lies, lies. How could you? Lies, lies. What the fuck? In my eyes, Sam was using Brian to fill her sad, empty life. I couldn't let that happen. She wanted drama she didn't deserve. She deserves shit. She doesn't get to barge in and start stealing the life I've only dreamed of. Stacy kept doing what she does best, digging into other secrets. She sent pictures of the little shit's diary pages to me. That's why I found out about the little trip to Colton Hill. It was our hideout since first year of high school, and her presence turned it into fucking nothing. How could be do this to us? <clears throat> hmm, maybe this is an ex-girlfriend that's taking over. The only way to break them apart was to show Brian what a creep she was. That's not very nice. What the fuck was that? I just, like, turned into something. I kept reading the disgusting words she wrote in her diary. At the same time, I felt something. A reminder of how I felt when I fell for B. How I felt so right and terribly wrong. Screaming into my pillow never helped with making the feelings go away. Did you find the diary yet? <coughs> Babe, I think you're taking this too seriously. Wow, Stacy's taking this too serious. Did you find it or not? I think she knows I'm sneaking into her room. I can't find it anywhere. Babe, don't you think you're too obsessed with breaking them up? You're bailing on me now? Forget it. Please, babe. Maybe Brian doesn't even like the girl. I just, oh. Okay, I'll just uh, not look at my phone anymore. That's that's fine. <laughs> so like. Uh, so like, there's this girl, right? And she's just the fucking worst. What's up, Big Meanie? Welcome in, buddy. Hope you're doing well. <clears throat> Is this a video game? Yes. A graphic novel. Um, no, it's it's definitely a video game because I'm I'm off doing other things. This is just the main focal point where I've noticed. Literally ninety percent reading. Stalker Simulator eight thousand. Yeah, honestly, <clears throat> I like reading. I like it conveys the story, and then when you least are you least expect it, boom, they hit you with something. <clears throat> this game, also the anxiety in this game is quite high. Um, not at the moment, but it's probably because we had stopped playing too. Uh, but something's going to be waiting for me eventually as I start reading this, I'm sure. Uh, November 7, 2006. The school counselor called me today. Mr. Ferns asked me if the rumors are true. Rumors that I've been leaving heart drawings all over school. Rumors that I've been stalking Brian. At this point, the whole school must be out of its mind. I didn't even know the letters in the fucking heart spelled S and B. And what? Just because the initials are S and B, suddenly every name that starts with them are either Sam or Brian? I guess even crazier words are on the streets. Sam Holt, the daughter of a sex offender, craves forbidden love. Ooh, that sucks. How on earth did Stacey find out about Dad? Why would she do so much to fuck up my life? And where the fuck is she? Is she... You know what? I'm tired. I'm tired of waiting for Brian to listen to me. I'm tired of looking for words to describe this fucked up situation. I can't believe I have to go through this again so far from home and so soon. Brian, please. Please say something. <laughs> yeah, come on, Brian guy. Uh-oh. We're out of space here. Then I remembered. She wrote something about her dad. It must have had something to do with her existence in my life. I started digging. It wasn't even a challenge. Keith Holt arrested for sexually assaulting a teenager. It was beautiful. I found the perfect ending. All I had to do next was fill in the rest of the story. Who the fuck does that? Jesus. Sam Holt calls Brian from a payphone in the middle of the night and sadly listens to his voice. Gina Hansen. How did Sam's dad even get married? He likes little girls, doesn't he? Maybe Sam's mom used to be the pervert's victim. God, that is so fucked. 
Sam Holt takes Brian's picture and keeps them hidden in her locker. That Sam girl's got some balls. Everyone's talking about her pervy dad and she's still showing up to class. Respect. Mike Koski. Sam Holt draws hearts all over the school to let others know Brian is hers. Brenda Johns. Oh my god, how could Sam Holt not kill herself? Jesus. If my dad went on the news for touching teens, that's bye-bye world for me, lol. That friend is a fucking bitch. An city girl with a huge hole to fill, a hole left by her sweet old daddy. She was just a disaster waiting to happen. No one, even Brian, would think otherwise. I made all the preparations while Stacy spread the rumors I created. It wasn't easy. I almost got caught taking a picture of Brian using the restroom. But I kept going. Every picture I took was a love confession I could never make. Every heart I drew was my sacrifice for him. Yo, what the fuck? When enough suspicion piled up on Sam, I stuffed all the pictures I took into her locker. It was a happy coincidence that B was there to see the spectacular unfoldment that happened. It was over. Things had both turned back to normal. Angel baby, welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. And then Stacy's drama filled head exploded. Oh god, that's quite the drawing. Why can't I fucking just go somewhere? No. Nothing there. Grab the what the fuck? I had a coward. Okay, well I can't really duck, so Oh, in here, in here, in here. Maybe well, you'll anytime, be able to live any again. Place, anywhere that I go, all the people seem to stop and stare. They say, why are you dressed like it's Halloween? You Halloween. look so absurd. You look so obscene. Good call on that. Good reference. Welcome in, Satan. <clears throat> yeah, long time no see. Hope you're doing well. Uh, happy to have you in. All right. I think I'm supposed to run over there or something now. Maybe you can run forever. Where am I supposed to go here? Just kidding, you're gonna die. What the fuck? I'm gonna watch you get away with the shit you've done to me. Do you really think I wouldn't find out what's going on? I'm even using me to break Sam and Brian apart so you can have some fun with her. Well, I had my share of fun when I told Brian what you've been doing. You should have seen the face of me when I got to the part of you drawing those retarded hearts all over school. <laughs> Excuse the R word. Hope you enjoy your happy life now that there's no Brian to get in your way. Oh, by the way, I saw you staring at that college poster. What, did you like the girl in the poster too? Is it why you tur tore her face off? You need help, but don't bother calling me Stacy. Wow. That's crazy. So Stacy actually took the side of Sam at some point. That's kind of nuts, so. <laughs> Please, man, Stacy got it all wrong. It's just a misunderstanding. It's a mis meaningless prank, that's all. Please, we don't do this. Text me back, please. Don't. The day Stacy told Brian was the last day he talked to me. He was so angry at me, he would never understand what I did for him. Typical. So fucking typical. Again, I was left alone to suffer. This time, someone had to pay for it. <clears throat> okay. An S. Well, Sam. What the fuck? That was fucking bizarre. Where's the other one? Natch Demstutz and a Rabar Baba Rabar Bar Baron Bart Sking Der Rabar Baba Rabar Baron Bart Barbie and Meist Mit Den Rabar Baba Rabar Bar Bar Baron Bart Baba 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 Baba
Oxytocin. Prost. Prost. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> there ain't nothing to do there. Can't look under the bed, it won't let me. There's some needles there, which is super sketch. Um, nothing here, nothing there. Uh, bathroom. There has to be another piece somewhere. Maybe not. Hmm. I don't know. What am I supposed to do here? I hate when the doors close automatically. It gets me every fucking time. Unless there's another random thing in one of these drawers. Nope. Oh, maybe I have to draw, draw it in. Maybe not. Batteries toast. I don't know what to do here. I looked like it was inside of a green locker when I put that thing down, but I don't think I have any lockers in here. What are those needles from? Um, honestly, I don't know. They just they've shown up over time. So bizarre. I don't know where this other fucking thing is. Wait, is that... No, it's not. I can't touch it. Nothing in there. <laughs> Jesus, fuck. Why did the goddamn bird just scare me? What's up, Soma? Huh. I don't see any other pieces of paper anywhere. I can't crouch. There's no button to crouch. There's no button to jump. Nothing on the inside of the doors. Nothing in there. Huh. I guess that's not really doing anything different. I know if it would like illuminate somewhere. Damn it all. Is there something on the back of one of these things? No, I can't ro rotate it. Huh. This is weird. There's like nothing on here. I can't go back. <laughs> Fuck. Thanks, Angel Baby, for the pits. Jesus. I can't go backwards. I can't go forwards. I've already used this one here. There has to be... Oop. There has to be another one somewhere. The question is where? Maybe it's in the... I didn't really look in the trash that well. No, it's just needles. Great. For all these different pieces of paper on the ground. Nothing. Absolutely fucking nothing. Fuck. <sighs> I don't know what I'm to do here. It's It's kind of weird, like... I put that piece of paper down. Is it under something on the desk? Not that I could tell. So I can't really move anything anyways, but... Yeah, I can't move this. It has to go here. Nothing here. I've got... The phone, but the battery is dying. Or it's dead. Can't grab anything here, nothing there, nothing there. I'll look through all these and see if something pops up. Jesus fucking Christ. Who 
did that? Angel baby. Not cool. <laughs> oh, I fucking hate that one. Because it always does the right side first. Well, my right. <laughs> and, uh... To my right is literally just the wall of my house. Like, if someone's knocking on that wall, they're either very tall or they're on a ladder, and I don't like it. Sorry, I'll stop. No, I mean... <laughs> it's there to have fun with. That's just an awful response of mine. Like, please stop, it hurts. Like, I can't write anything anywhere. What's the point of this pencil? Kind of sucks. It would have been cool if I could have just drawn something in right here. But I figured that was Sam, because it's the girl with the pony, you know, has a ponytail, so that went to S. So who's K? And I think that's the girl that... is here, which is just weird that I'm not able to do anything here. I'll double check the bathroom, I suppose. But I'm just not feeling any of this. Can't open the tank, can't open the bowl. Nothing in the sink. Nothing on the other side of the mirror. Just toilet paper and a big old toothbrush. Okay. Nothing back here. I can't close the door while I'm in here. Just odd. Like, where am I missing? Maybe something somewhere. None of these trash bags are selected. <laughs> Soma. Nothing, 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 nothing. It kind of sucks because, like, I was in a good spot, and the game was getting really good. And I had to stop, because I had shit that I had to do. In between the morning stream, or the, which is the afternoon stream and the evening stream, we come back, and now it's like, fucking deadlock. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> like, I... Nothing pops up differently over those three. It just does the whole thing. Shit, this, why did the fart scare me? My god. Meanie, go change your shorts, my guy. I'll change mine after. Holy fuck. Come on, there's nothing up there, really? Fuck you. I don't know. Like, is the game busted? Let me go quit. Oh shit, that actually breaks the whole fucking game. Whoops. My bad. <laughs> We're just gonna reload. Um, maybe we hit a little bit of a bug where something wasn't occurring. So I continue, come on, continue. We should leave off, yeah. Because the tra uh, progress is tra attracted by the cork board up there. Okay, cool. Here we are. So what if I put this here instead? So it's clearly the wrong spot. I put it in S and watch what happens. What, like, what the hell was that? I'm just in a locker, like at school. And now I'm stuck. Nothing to fucking do. I may need to look up a, a guide on this because I, I don't I don't know what to do. It, you clearly need another drawing. But like I can't I can't draw anything, even though I have a pencil. A fucking pencil.
I mean, look at this. You would think with a pencil in hand I could just draw something here. Just draw it over. Just but no. Demon, what's up, buddy? Welcome in. Um, yeah, so that doesn't do anything. The cell phone battery's probably still dead. Yep, still dead. I can't grab that from here, but it's just a note. There's nothing on it. I've checked both these notes and the entire progress of all those notes. I'm so confused. Like, you'd think I'd be able to draw or, like, go back and find a piece of it or something. A little late, I guess. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, um, yeah, it's almost midnight already. Surprised you're awake. But, regardless, happy to have you. We're just kind of at an impasse with this game right now because I'm just confined to this goddamn house little apartment and I can't find whatever they want me to put there like there's no option to do anything with the bed even look underneath it can't do anything with those portraits on the wall or that one I can't touch that up there it's definitely broke I looked at the walkthrough which movie you type K? I tried typing K. It didn't do anything. I looked at the walkthrough. Shit. Okay. Well. So I guess we're just kind of fucked. <laughs> I'm assuming it's supposed to load that section in the locker room. Oh, delayed start tomorrow. That's always fun. So, yeah, kind of. Okay. Like, would you say, when that pops up and you're in the locker, should I immediately press something? Like, does someone do something in the locker that they turn around? Like, maybe there's a weird issue where you have to act immediately. And I'm not, because I'm not even pressing anything. I'm literally just watching. Because if it's like, oh, like, click, or move forward, or turn around, we can do that. Kind of the two weeks ago, the dev completely re-released the game. Yeah, this should be the, um, the most updated version. Excuse me. So the walkthrough I found looks different. Ah, gotcha. Like, very different? Yikes. Huh. That's... Peculiar. Um... Well, like the part you're at isn't in the walkthrough. Wow. No, Walking Dead has to end. They're, uh, they're, they ended the comics a couple of years ago. Um, which, if, if anyone has... If, you, if you're not even a fan of comic books, I feel like those are a good one to start. Um, because it's... They're, they're, earlier on, they're very similar to the show in a lot of ways, but a lot of things are already different, heads up. Um, it's a lot more brutal in the comics. Yeah, I went to like five looking for it and couldn't find it, so unless it's in the book somewhere. But I, yeah, I can't do anything with the book though, because if you look on the edges, see red and red? I can't, if I click, it does nothing. Well, right click does that. I can't click anything there. Can't click anything there. I can't pick that back up. There's nowhere else I can click on to do anything here. I, there has to be another, um, like, stick figure that I have to put there. Um, so if it's in the book, I can't get to it. And the pencil doesn't do anything. Smacking the shit of the K. So you're stuck here. Yeah, it's essentially where we're at. Which is a huge bummer. Um... Tell you what, I'm going to pop some music on, and I'm going to have to go look up a, a walkthrough myself, try to help everybody out here. 
This is Love Sam Stuck. Uh, page with stick figures. <clears throat> Hmm. I don't want. I don't want all that. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, sometimes the Steam community page is pretty decent with these things too. So let me see what that one looks like. Yeah, major update. Sam rewrite update is live. This is on October twenty fifth. So. Just a few days before. Three years since Love Sam launched my small passion project before taking a big step as a game developer, I decided to give my firstborn a better care than it deserves. Rewrite Update is more of a remake than an update. It is a complete renewal aimed at, at making Love Sam feel like a polished game with a more fluid gameplay and intense reading experience. Uh, gameplay overhaul, enhanced visuals, text revised, text translation coming soon. I just want to play the original version of Love Sam. You can always go to the beta tab and choose legacy version. All right, why well, doesn't really help me there? <clears throat> yeah, there's some updates back in August, but nothing had to do with that. Weird. Let's look at the community content. All right, maybe there's a guide somewhere. How to move in Love Sam. That's not what I was looking for at all. And that's the only guide that's on here. Sent me a Discord message. Okay, so I had some, there's some extra pieces up there, it looks like. That's weird. change that whole section yeah and I wonder if it broke something but I'm trying to find anything that explains that like if anyone's hit this at all discussions Yeah, I've only seen two, three things posted since the rework. Hmm. Let's see. So this one says game keeps crashing. I have to boot up though. Yeah, it's not the same thing. <sighs> yep, the dev came in and said, hey, we fixed this. So that's obviously off the table. Let's see. Games broken, IDK. I got no pen, no phone, table and chair are different, and I came and progressed past the first question, lol. Okay. Stuck on don't look away and rewrite version of game. Uh, we got it through that, though. And that's not a bug, this person that's talking, because I actually realized that, too what my issue was. Um, great, so that's not relevant at all. Um, 
fuck. Both characters supposed to be there. Yeah, I had another character there to begin with, but I think it I used it on something. But it was also it was also a guy. It didn't and I had to do it to get past that part of the page. But this should definitely be two girls. Because they're both fighting over Brian. That's unfortunate. Uh, I'm gonna start a new discussion then. Enter a title. Rewrite. Game breaking bug. the stick figure of the one with a ponytail on S and I quickly flash to what looks like the inside of a green locker. However, I flash back to the room immediately where nothing happens there is no hidden second stick figure nor can i go backwards or forwards in the diary hopefully this is just me missing something if so, hints would be super helpful for a fix if this is truly a bug. Thank you. See, I'm very, very uh, polite, asking for help. All right, cool. So that'll do its thing. So honestly, with that said, I don't think there's really much we can really do now with this game, unfortunately. Um, so I'm going to have to quit out at this point and just say, you know, sorry, maybe next time. It is what it is. But I think we'll fix it eventually, you know, we'll get past it. Um, so let's see. I guess we have really two options in front of us right now also why do i still have this I, I don't need to have the outlast trials sitting on here anymore because that shit is over with where is it there it is yeah i could just uninstall that while we're waiting <laughs> so i think we have it's really two options. Um, uninstall the fucking thing. God damn it. All right. Well, that's going to take forever, apparently. Um, so we could either move forward and give the Knight of the Scissors a try. Or, since it is kind of late. Um, not necessarily. Hey, Heavy. Um, not ending. Just the, the game I was just playing kind of bugged out on me. So we're trying to decide what to do. Um, I think we're going to do either the Knight of the Scissors, which is, uh, it, it kind of has that retro feel that like Papa Combo does. Okay, good. I was lied to. Huh. Oh, it's time, baby. Oh, heavy. Oh my God. <laughs> I hit her for 140 stopped and still died. <laughs> oh no yo jam's in here too welcome in jam welcome in raiders welcome in heavy 
Can you, can you be, can you, what? You still have the look of disgust well, on you. Well, I was going to go in, yeah. But I actually didn't know I was here. Boo. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Thank you all for dropping in. Uh, we were just playing Love, Sam. Uh, unfortunately, it seems like right as we're getting to, like, the real meat and potatoes of that story and, like, towards, like, the end game, uh, it decided to just uh, have a little bugsy wugsy where we can't move forward. It is what it is. We've let the... Uh, developer know about it hopefully it could get fixed or maybe it's me being dumb and i'm just missing something jam i've been good um very good actually uh i hope you've been well i was uh watching a good chunk of your 24-hour stream at least through lurking uh but it looked like you were having a good time gonna go to sleep good night fry have a great night i hope you can consistently feel a little bit better each day if not a ton better each day uh super appreciate you uh, yeah, thank you. Bet you have you won't play it. I'm positive you are correct. Um, I think I missed the part that you told me what game it was. Let me see here. Gotta find a game that had your name all over it. 29 hours? Damn, Jim. Holy fuck, man. Well, hey. Honestly, tip of the cap to you, sir. That's that's a long stream. I gotta find it. I can't think of the name. Super helpful. I love you either way, buddy. <laughs> um, so, uh, again, if you've uh, coming over here, part of the raid, thanks for hanging out. Uh, we are doing uh, Jugtober. Um, Endoparasitic. I don't know about that. I've never heard of that one. GM, have you heard Endoparasitic? Let me know if you have. Or anyone else for that matter, obviously. Uh, so yeah, so Jugtober, uh, even though October is over, we're in the overtime period, my friends. Uh, this last week, we go in ham. Wish that on Steam, it's totally in your lane. Okay. I guess I shall. Um... So yeah, we, uh, nah, I never heard of it. Interesting. Endoparasitic. $9.99. Not bad. Three limbs ripped off, infected with a deadly parasite. You must save your research. Drag yourself through the quarters of a secret research lab on a remote asteroid. Fight off horribly mutated monsters. Inject countless syringes of vaccines and survive at all costs. Very positive rating just dropped on October 24th, a little over a week ago. Oh, this looks hilarious. Like, a good hilarious. Oh, wow. The loading system for the shotgun, because all you have is one hand. On, oh, like, the weapon selection. Oh, this looks fun. Yeah, adding that to my wish list. Thank you, Heavy. I appreciate that. Looks pretty damn good. Oh, man, you stopped playing Vistage, you should complete it. It's a great game. Uh, so, yeah, so with Jugtober, um, for the rest of this week through Sunday, uh, any subs, bits, uh, uh, sound alerts, anything that basically has monetary value tied to it is going to go right into the charity. Um, if you're looking to actually donate, which would be fucking real cool, uh, if you either see the link that's in the chat that I sent out there, or if you scroll down, there's a little panel called Tiltify, and uh, that's basically where all the funds are being collected, and then they are dispersed directly uh, over to uh, Hope for the Day. Look at this sexy fuck. Who? No, it's you, One Speed. How you doing, buddy? Welcome in. Are you pro or anti-war crime? <laughs> God, that's quite the question. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Lots of lots of chatting. I, it's hard for me to keep up. Sorry. I smoke enough weed. You can convince me whichever way. <laughs> well, homie, just winding down for the night. Just had to come in and say hello. Appreciate you coming through and hanging out, dude, and saying hi. Most appreciated. 
Um, I hope you, yeah, so, uh, you know, what did I see you playing recently? Oh, I think I saw you playing Father's Day. That was a good one. I really enjoyed that one. I think having Emeka Games back and dropping stuff is is, is good for everybody. <laughs> Maybe not for Heavy. Heavy wasn't a fan of Emeka Games. He played Summer 58 for about two nights and quit. <laughs> Never made it far enough or established enough to mess with that stuff. Also, no DLC or mods. I don't know what game you guys are fucking talking about. Your butt is small. I mean, you're the short one. Uh, so out of curiosity, are people into the Night of the Scissors, or do we play Vampire Survivors for a couple runs and we have uh, Twitch integration running? I think we'll do a poll. Let's do a poll. Who wants to do a poll? Polls are fun. Send butt big heart. <laughs> Thanks, baloney boy. <laughs> you know I like vampires, kid. Want to see the new stuff? Shrug loves my poll. Sometimes. Okay, so I guess it's vampire survivors. Don't even mention Night of the Scissors. That's easy for me. Well, Jam did. Okay. <laughs> All right. I think it's pretty straightforward. We'll, we'll do vampire survivors, but, but, you know, it's fine because it's already quarter past twelve. We'll get like one or two runs out of this, and then call it a night. Uh, tomorrow. Do we still get your poll? I mean, if you want it. Uh, Night of the Scissors will definitely start tomorrow. I'm trying to beat every level with every character. Yes, you told me you were doing that. Uh, let me just update my shit here. And then we'll do Remothered after that. I haven't played VS in a long time, got stolen characters and gave up. Pretty proud of you seeing your slang and keeping up, homie. Thanks, thanks, one speed. Thank you, dude. You, the words of encouragement from a legend such as yourself. Thank you. Playing Father's Day and oh yeah, Outlast Trials. Yes, we played Outlast Trials last night. That was a good, uh, it's a good time. I just played it solo. Um, I played the, like the opening scene and I just played that one uh, trial they had unlocked. I played it once um, on easy because I'm a puss bag, but it was good. Where's some characters that can't beat boss rush or uh, bone zone and it's just <laughs> wait wait why don't you buy trombone champ and play that but i think i did i think i did actually purchase it but the vampire survivors has spoken and you can also be a part of this uh because it's there's a, there's a um uh it, it's it's uh interactive now through twitch chat lots of frustrating to get to like 25 28 minutes and die uh Cool. Updated that shiz. Oh, you've never seen Vampire Survivors, Baloney Boy? You've come to the right place. No way, I'd much rather watch you blow some of my favorite tunes. Damn. Well, okay. Maybe we'll maybe we'll look into it after, but You know what sucks? There's not that many hard games I know on console. All of those Subnautica. Resident Evil Little Nightmares and Visage. There's a lot more than that. It's just whether or not they're necessarily good. <laughs> That's the problem. Um, what the fuck? Dude. You can't even see what I was just doing. I literally clicked on, like, click any button to continue to get the screen to pop up here for Vampire Survivors. As the main menu popped up, that just hit. I know you can't see it, but that was perfect fucking timing. <laughs> 